porn. El Rojo. Uh, I would have to say. Wait a minute. Oh shit! Oh, El Rojo, Mexico, feeling the power of that oh, Cobra. Gosh, going back to your question, I would have to say Santino Morello. I mean, like he's been doing guy, do, doing guy. He's been doing great. Because he beat Morikai a few weeks ago on ECW. There you go. Santino is gone, though. We are down to two former TV champions. El Rojo, Mexico, and Paul London. Both men athletic. Oh! Rojo is a two-time television champion. Was the very first when the title was christened as such. London, of uh, course. He's looking for an escape rate. Uh, trying to get Paul London out of here. Trying to do anything he can to get him over the top rope. He's yep. got him. He's almost there. Oh. But no. London skins the cat and he's back in the ring. Oh, drop toe hold. Irojo. He's been looking good since his return. Those ball. Two time TV champion Rojo. Frank Dog will have to check that later for me. Thank you, Frank Dog, for bringing in some bags. Oh, I on the pie. Oh. Miss drop kick. Both, very nice form from Paul London. Both men are just very athletic in this match. Wait a minute. Paul London going to go for elimination. No. Oh. Rojo. Rojo is gone. Paul London. Wait a minute. What the? Uh, what? What? Ruth. What? What is he doing out here? What the? What? Our truth with this little. He, he just. He, uh, he, he. We'll find he, out later, I guess. Uh, he he's talking to Michael Cole now. The Shelton Benjamin's talking to Michael Cole. He wants another one contenders match. He wants to be in. He he wants to make this a triple threat. And will will Cole will Cole accept? He's getting another. He's not getting another shot. No. If if he if he loses, he's not getting another shot. Yes, we're from Mobile. Yes. Woo! Here comes. Uh, uh, oh. Boy. I'm sorry. Boy, guys. Back uh, up. Good. Yeah. Cool. Uh, you good enough, man? Yeah, I feel like an amateur. I'm sorry, guys. Um. Here yeah. comes Barrett. You're just in time. For our main event, brother. Main event time. Kennedy versus Wade Barrett. The past couple weeks ago, Wade Barrett did beat Kennedy. And now both men want title shots, and they're going to face off right now. That is correct. Kennedy! Kennedy! For Kennedy's a former world heavyweight champion. You cannot count the man out. You never count on Mr. Kennedy. Can't Mr. Kennedy is probably one of the best technical wrestlers in WEDF today. And I believe he can he, if he comes out on winner tonight, I can see I can see his name lights. BCCW championship maybe or world heavyweight championship. Well boy, let's go back to earlier. Like you were talking about Mr. Kennedy beating um, coming out on top and facing Mark uh, not Mark Kennedy, he beat Will Jackson for the ECW World Title, but we, we both agree that nobody can stop Ezekiel Jackson. For right now, nobody can stop Ezekiel Jackson. But what I believe is that in fact, for powerhouses, in my my strategy, if you can out wrestle a powerhouse without giving into the power, the power moves of a wrestler, then you can be the best. You can you can beat him. You can come out the winner. A former. W World Champion Shelton Benjamin looking to get back in this match. Looking to get back his title. No stopping me. Hey, no stopping me. No. Shelton Benjamin. Stopping me. I don't stop. Shelton Benjamin, remember though, he, he is in this triple threat match now. And if he does not win, he will not get another shot. At Ezekiel Jackson's ECCW championship, so long as Zeke is the champion. I don't believe that that Shelton Benjamin even deserves another shot. He had his chance at the Fiddle Four Way match, and he lost. 
he, I think, I believe that's a good enough but, rematch. Thoughts and why but, does Kennedy have a show? But, you know, you gotta look at it from Shelton Benjamin's perspective. The man was screwed out of his ECCW championship to begin with, and he did make a big statement to the ECCW oh. champion by attacking him earlier let's take tonight. A look, let's take a look at this. Shelton Benjamin and Mr. Kennedy is teaming up on Barry. Because nobody this likes Barry. part strategy. This is that and the fact that oh. Barry is the bigger guy in the match, and plus it's smart strategy to do it in a triple threat anyway. Team up on one guy and then keep it between yourselves. That strengthens your chances of winning the match. Let's remember Kennedy. It really does. Kennedy. Oh, Bulldog. Back then, Kennedy. Oh, no, here comes now, Mr. Kennedy. <laughs> oh, this is correct. Frank Dog, thank you for reminding me about this. Mr. Kennedy and Shelton Benjamin are both big time rivals. Remember, Shelton Benjamin was an original Money in the Bank winner, the first one at that but mr kennedy would wind up beating shelton benjamin for his money in the bank at the first ever wedf fate of champions then would go on and cash in to become the world heavyweight champion after um i believe he defeated edge after a tlc match being him at last resort it, it all happened on the same night last resort oh Here's a cover! Oh, the money in the bank at Fate of Champions, that's right. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, now they're just working on Barrett like and Kool-Aid Kool Kool just told me he's done. It's just me and you now, Steven. Uh, See what you got. Alright, alright. Well, shout Benjamin. Oh, nice suplex. What is Barrett doing? Buster. Brain Buster variation. Whoa! Right on his head, but Barrett! Pulls out the sledgehammer. Remember oh. what? what? <laughs> well, I, I believe this is a uh, no disqualification. Triple threats usually are no disqualification to begin with anyway. Oh, the ref is out. Why is he going for a pin? He took out the ref with that sledgehammer. It's it's not even it's not even smart at that to do it when you know, considering Shelton Benjamin was wide awake and was able to see him clearly pin him anyway. Yes. I just want to take note right here. Frank Dog says that he's sorry to all. <clears throat> Kool Aid. I mean, Kool Aid. That's I'm sorry. I I'm not a good thinker in this, right? <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> I got good. I wasn't either. Hey, fate. Of, I've confused fate of champions with um last resort. That's but in any case, so Ben's been taking control. Oh no, it was home. There now getting in the hands of Kennedy. Kennedy looking for it here. Nice suplex. The cover rope break. Dalton Benjamin going up high. Where's he going? Oh! The Bulldog by Mr. Kennedy. Take this as a vantage point. Mr. Kennedy going for the cover. This could be it. Here's a wide. Two. Oh, two. Oh, no. Dalton Benjamin saving the match. He does want an idol, another title shot at Bragging Rights. But he has to get through two men right now. Right. He okay. does have to get through um and to be embarrassed. Oh, you were talking from uh Benjamin's perspective. That's correct. Good. Okay. Now Benjamin with a German suplex. Yes. Mixing it up with uh rival Kennedy there. The Kennedy oh belly the belly, nice. Could be it right here. Shelton Benjamin wants to cover. Barrett's down, but Kennedy quickly gets the shoulder up. Hey, here comes. Oh, this is correct. Don't forget about how Kennedy was reintroduced into WDF. Uh, Wade Barrett made an open challenge weeks ago. Mr. Kennedy rose to the occasion and accepted that challenge, and I believe he. Uh, Barrett beat him. Yes. Here's a and cover. It started a rivalry, but Shelton Benjamin had a T-bone cover, I think. Uh, T-bone suplex and followed with a pin. Oh, what a clothesline by Barrett. Running rough shot on both Kennedy and Benjamin. They seem to be both teaming up on Kennedy, though, but oh, wait a minute, Benjamin! Oh, German suplex almost landing on that sledgehammer. That would have been bad, real bad. Yes, it would have. But wait a minute. Oh, Samoan drop. Oh, right onto the wood of that sledgehammer. 
Blake must have caught him, but wait a minute. Shelton Benjamin. I think he's gonna... Nope. Ooh, nice drop. Heel kick. Jump it. Oh! Nice big splash into the corner out. Now he's gonna work on Barry. Now, wait a minute. Oh! Super kick to the face. Classic Shelton Benjamin right there. And Benjamin could be signaling for the end. Anything could be happening, but Benjamin Payton! There it is! Wait a minute, here comes Mr. Kennedy! Kennedy throws him to the outside! Wait Knock him out! He's gonna steal it! He got it right there! He's gonna steal it! He's gonna steal it! One! Two! Two! Three! Wow! Kennedy just stole Shelton Benjamin's win! That was, that was a very clever trick there by Mr. Kennedy, you gotta admit. Shelton Benjamin finished off Wade Barrett. Kennedy runs in while he's on his feet, and he just gets Benjamin out of the picture. And because of it, Mr. Kennedy is now the new number one contender to the ECCW World Heavyweight Championship. Uh, indeed, he's going to drag and right to face the big man, Ezekiel Jackson. But who can beat that man? Will it be Kennedy? It, it could be anybody. You know, many men have tried. Mr. Kennedy's going to be the next one. We'll see if the former world heavyweight champion can stop the Mastodon known as Ezekiel Jackson. And he's really picking up the win. It's been a great night on ECCW. He's Steven. I'm with Jax. And for Frank Dog and for Kool Aid with the K, we will see you next time in the future. Until then, true believers, we'll see you next time. Good night. And the Miz will become the WEDF champion.